Hi everyone, so I'm about to share another journal with you and this is another um, another journal using uh, Artie Maisie's new kit called Something Shabby and this time I decided to do a Traveller's Notebook size. So um, it measures eight and a quarter by four and a half. It has one signature that is 52 pages front and back. Um, I've used this uh, discontinued uh, Melissa Francis paper and I can't remember the name of it now um, but I've had it for ages and I just thought it was very you know the colours were like quite um, good to use with this kit um, <clears throat> so I've made a topper for the front um, and it's using all the elements from the kit and some of the background pages some cheesecloth here we've got eyelets and organza ribbon as a closure um, we've got some lace trims and tabs on the side this will be listed in my shop if you're interested um, I have reduced some of my journals um, that are still in the shop if you want to have a peek um, <clears throat> and all the videos are um, my dog's gonna start barking now because I think someone's coming to the door <laughs> uh, okay um, yeah she's barking hopefully the dragged her in the house <laughs> so this is one of the pages from the kit um, and here I've used some of the background pages to make pockets. This is some of the elements from the kit as well. Such a beautiful kit. Um, I've made these tags up using some um, like ledger type papers from the old design shop. So there's a few of them throughout the journal. Uh, a tag from the kit and I've just put tabs on them. Um, I've used some of the Victorian beauties again. Used some of the background papers to make some tags and then pop some tabs on there as well. This is a little double journal card. Done some stamping, got some of this crocheted trim on here. Some more stamping. Uh, this is, I think, either the old design shop or the graphics fairy. And I've done the, use my binder all to do the, this punching down the side. Here we've got um, a postcard from the kit. This is the old design shop. That away, coffee dyes. And this is an envelope from the kit. And that's just paper clipped on there. There's paper inside there, just like coffee dyed paper in the envelope for you to scribble on, um, journal on. <laughs> uh, another big tag, got some lace trim on there, some lined paper there, some stamping, another tab. This is one of the pages from the kit and I made a pocket with that one, done some stitching at top and bottom. We have another postcard from the kit and that's another tag from the kit. Such, I love the colours of this. This is one of the background pages and I've just done a like a tag for you to journal on or stick things on, however you journal. Um, some more stamping, corner pocket from the kit and these are from the kit and that's a journal card from the kit and another little Victorian beauty in there well, we have another page from the kit um, another pocket that I made <clears throat> I used some of the background paper to make this little tab because some of the one of the pockets in the kit has got something similar which I've done on the other side somewhere so I've just put this element on here one of these little labels and that piece there and obviously the paper there is one of the background pages from the kit another tag and I think my light is flickering um, I've had it on for quite a while because um, one of my lamp my lights have blown so I, it, one went the other week and now another one's gone <laughs> it's typical um, another little um, journal card there so I think it's been on too long, the ring light. Uh, some more of this punching, um, some more lace trim, another tab, center of the signature, done that on the pizza pan. And lots of journal room here. Another pocket and another tag, another journal card there another little tag using the Victorian beauty and on this this was the Melissa Francis paper and I don't know if you can see but there's like two little girls on there um, a postcard 
uh, that was the other pocket that you get with the kit and it comes with that little strip and that's why I done whatever it was I done <laughs> that kind of mimicking that um, <clears throat> another uh, ledger type tag this is one of the tags from the kit as well and another Victorian beauty I like that she looks like she's kind of thinking of the little rosies there and another double journal card we've got a little stunt plane going over and I can just I don't know if you'll be able to hear it on here but it's going over and it's it's called the Red Baron and it normally does it like obviously when the better weather is in and we've got some really good weather and it goes around and it you know it goes upside down and does circles and everything and I think there's quite a lot of people out watching it at the moment um and I'm missing it. <laughs> Another tag. I used some of the labels here. Created this pocket using some of the background pages. Another tag from the kit. Another journal card from the kit. Another tabby there. And uh, another postcard. And that's from the old design shop. And this is obviously an envelope. And it just got some coffee dyed paper in there. Which... Got that stuck just like that and there's one in the other one that I didn't actually pull the paper out in and that just goes there so yeah we've had really nice weather over the last couple of days and we're in for a little bit of a heat wave this weekend which is really nice um <clears throat> we've got the paddle of the swimming pool out for the grandkids um one of them's just turned up I believe another tag there that's the old design shop and i just chopped it up to make tags <clears throat> some more of that punch in there some more stamping made this other pocket background paper one of the um journal cards from the kit and then this is one of the little elements from the kit and inside there we have another tag and there we go so the next time i use this kit i'm gonna because andrea's done this like tone on tone so on the video that I done the other day and um, with the little fabric mini one that I made I showed you a few bits because I did print some out um, and literally forgot all about them when I planned on doing this one I thought oh I should have done it in the other color as well like maybe mixed and matched it um, so yeah I'm gonna probably do that next use <clears throat> obviously it's the same kit just in a different tone um, so yeah that should keep me busy for a while one kit two different tones um so yeah this like i said this will be listed in my shop my other journals have been reduced i'm only going to keep i was only going to keep them reduced for yet for one day but it's bank holiday weekend i'm going to keep it until monday so any journals that are on there or getting uploaded from then i will do them at a reduced price i won't do them like probably the five pound off basically five pound that's um uk money um so yeah i'll knock five pound off um what i would normally put the the journals up for um so yeah so if you have any questions just ask have a great weekend and i'll speak to you all soon bye